Hello, this is Nick with nickscomputerfix.com and here's a video on what you are going to need to run Windows 11 on your computer laptop and other computer devices. We are talking about the requirements for CPU, RAM, storage, and other items. First of all, let's go ahead and determine if Windows 11 is available for your computer already. And we can do that by going down to our Start menu here and left clicking on our Start menu and then move up to the Settings icon. Left click on that and that opens up the Settings window. And we'll move over to the last item here, which is Update and Security. Go ahead and left click on that. And that opens up the Windows Update window, where I can see if Microsoft has pushed the uh, Windows 11 upgrade down to my computer. And in my case, it has not. It just gives me a get ready for Windows 11 to see if this PC can run the Windows 11, check hardware requirements. Well, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, click on check for updates and maybe... Um, just maybe Microsoft will push that down to me, the Windows 11 upgrade. And in my case, um, I still did not get the uh, Windows 11 upgrade pushed down to my computer. So it tells me to go ahead and check the hardware requirements. So I'm going to go over to the right hand side here and click on check hardware requirements. And that takes me to the Microsoft website. And right here it tells me we're working on it. We're doing some extra testing to make sure Windows 11 is ready for certain PCs. Yours is included. I'm going to go ahead and click on see specifications. And basically that takes me to the top of this page here. And it says find Windows 11 specs, features, and computer requirements. And the next section, which is right below here, I'm going to scroll down, says the system requirements. And it shows me what the minimum system requirements for installing Windows 11 on a PC are. So if we go down here, down the column, processor, it has to be one gigabytes or better. I need four gigabytes of RAM at least. Storage, I need 64 gigabytes at least. And then it shows me the firmware for my BIOS, TPM, um, the minimum graphics card that I need with DirectX 12. I need a display of 720 or better. And I need a internet connection. So definitely need internet in order to install Windows 11. Keep that in mind. And then I can scroll down a little bit more. I can see feature specific requirements for Windows 11. And then I scroll a little bit more. I can see some other items that are pertinent to Windows 11 as well as languages. So um, keep that in mind. And uh, these are the system requirements. So check them out. See if your computer meets these requirements. And if they do, awesome. If they don't, you might consider either upgrading your hardware or getting a new computer if you want Windows 11. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching. And it would be greatly appreciated if you subscribe to my channel. That would be totally awesome. And leave a like if you like. Have a great day or night.